to me, punk is is freedom. Um, it's it's really just living your life without worrying about um, what other people think. And I'm focusing on people of color who I believe have a punk spirit. Hey, welcome to my studio. Thanks for coming by. Thank you. <laughs> Come on in. <laughs> I just wanted to, to just show, I guess a feeling of just freedom and happiness. So she's just so free that she's able, like, she's just bend, you know, bending all the way back. Um, but it's just, just about freedom and expression. All the people that I painted for the Punk Noir series have Austin ties. And they're all people that I know and, and that I feel inspired by. I've heard from black people that have said that you know they got made fun of for maybe listening to a certain kind of music or dressing a certain kind of way even though punk does have some roots in african culture and there are there are people of color um, and you know that enjoy it um, it's, it's often seen as a movement that's not for people of color so i'm scratching uh, some of the people out to to represent erasure i'm using copper leaf um, be because I wanted to really kind of to, to portray energy and to, sh to show energy and um, copper is like like the second best conductor of electricity and next to silver silver and I also like just the, the look um, you know the aesthetic quality of it I want to explore more of my myself and my own background I am Nigerian American and my, my father is is Nigerian. My mother is Black American, um, but I I grew up just raised in American culture, um, and I didn't really get to experience much much of the Nigerian side. So I, def I definitely see myself exploring that with my art. Yeah, this this one is called the the Three Graces, and it, she layered like three times, and is just is showing how we have personas that make up our. Our personalities. So I scratched out some parts um, just to kind of again to show that feeling of of erasure um, within within punk. My goal would be to be able to to live full time off of my art, and I'm not sure what that will look like or you know exactly what, what I'll be doing. I'm at a point in my life where I feel like it's just now or never. So right now, that art is art is my life, and I'm just putting 100% of my efforts into it. Yeah.